2024 Super Aeronautique G23 sitting in an onyx black or I'm sorry a jet black hull bottom anthracite rear stripe haze gray main and interior deck and we have a telescoping tower option on here in haze gray with anthracite uh, secondary panel on it just a mean looking boat sits on a tandem axle uh, boatmate trailer in black as well black wheels and spare have a uh, three-step ladder up in the front really pretty boat did 30% window tint on the windshield black chromax uh, badging on the exterior and the interior of the boat telescoping tower package comes with the framed bimini top with surf pockets on the roof we have strapless Nautique board racks on there on either side. And then uh, two pairs of JL88 tower speakers in the uh, custom enclosures, as you can see, kind of tucked away up underneath the Bimini top. We have Nautique surf system. We have Nautique Integrated Steer Assist with a thruster right here, as you can see. Surf pipe. As well as a platform mounted ladder. Get up close on this metal flake. Anthracite always looks amazing. Pretty good depth of color in the anthracite metal flake. When you get out in the sun, it shows a lot of gold. Maybe even a tinge of, uh, of blue to it. So it's not just kind of a... You know, a neutral looking gray when you get it in the sun it looks really really pretty beautiful body lines coming down the side of the g23 make for a more rigid boat so this thing uh, handles chop incredibly well and feels super super sturdy on the water up front we have docking lights on either side I'm a big fan of this one. I think it looks amazing. Let's jump inside, check out the interior on this G23. Also have these nice steps for hopping up into the boat on the trailer. As we jump onto the platform, here we go. See nice, massive transom seats on either side. You got cup holders, nice high seat backs on them so they're very comfortable to sit in. Uh, we have a transom cooler in here with the tow point for tubing or pulling skiers back here as well, which leads us up into the interior where we have a haze gray main on our vinyl. We did tungsten gray true weave on our uh, texture panel. Then we have um, our accent piping in um, anthracite. Soft Max with black seat boxing and black stitching. Those really nice stitching accents all through the interior. It's really, really nice. Did a gray C deck through the interior as well. It's a nice neutral scheme. Um, some different textures going on in the vinyl to kind of break it all up. So I think it looks really good. crack open our back storage here all of our ballast is subfloor this boat does have the supplemental ballast option so you have uh, 3,800 pounds of ballast total all subfloor so underneath that panel if you open that up you'd see one of the, the five ballast bags in there each bag is on its own ballast pump as well so this system fills uh, the same amount of time as the standard ballast system does because they add two extra pumps. But subfloor ballast equals tons of storage space. So you got all the room in the world for gear and boards in the back of the G23, the most storage in really any wake boat that you're gonna find. Is equipped with the uh, PCM ZZ6 engine, 6.2 liter direct injection, 450 horsepower, does an excellent job. Um, it's kind of how we set up pretty much all of our G23s with that engine smooth it's quiet and uh, does really well for surfing and wakeboarding regardless of the amount of weight you have in the boat 
checking out the interior. This does have the Studio Elite stereo package, so it has six of these uh, JL speakers behind the grills like you see there. With the Wavefront speakers under the dash, or under the windshield rather. And then you have dual 12 inch subs. There's one under here and one under the love seat, which we'll see in a moment, which are vented throughout the sides of the boat. Uh, perforated combing pad areas for the base to kind of leak through. Um, storage on either side, nice deep storage that communicates into the back. It's all C-Deck line and finished out really nicely. Over here, same deal communicating all the way to the back. All of our seats are on hinges, self-supporting hinges, so everything stays open so when you're loading gear in and out, you don't have a seat cushion trying to clamshell shut onto your hand. We have transformable seating. So you can flip up both our starboard and port side seats, as you can see here. Or it can be a nice bench seat like you saw before. And then a famous rear-facing center seat that slides on the track. And you've got excellent wake view seating. It's super comfortable. People can kick their feet up over here and just lay back and watch their friends and family cruise behind the boat. When you're done, slide the seat right back into place. Easy as that. Did it with one hand. Telescoping tower, I'll take a quick peek at that. This is in the up position, but it does fold all the way down to about here. Um, you can see in our listing uh, some photos of the tower in the down position if you'd like. Uh, clamping board racks here, as you can see. I mentioned surf pockets. You've got those up top on the roof. Great spot to store your surfboards, wakeboards, foils, whatever you have in the boat. This bimini top is super beefy and very well built, and it can handle about anything you can throw up there. Um, telescoping tower can be uh, as can be operated in the down position or the up position. So if you get caught in a rainstorm or you just want a little bit more shade in the boat, you can still uh, you can drop that tower and still pull your your friends and family behind the boat. This has the enhanced courtesy lighting package. So you have your lighted cup holders that kind of illuminate our side panels really nicely here with our Chromax trim. Also your courtesy lighting down here, a couple different areas in the boat. Change colors along with the cup holders and then your Nautique logos on the seat backs too. Down on the floor, we have a full size drop-in cooler match to the uh, C-Deck scheme and Chromax of the boat. Best spot for a cooler, for sure, hands down. And then we can open up our storage under the love seat here, where we have our trash can. Love it, access from the walkthrough, no one has to get up out of their seat to throw their stuff away. And you see uh, one of the two 12 inch subs, uh, for the stereo and then all three JL digital amplifiers up top. Love seat is heated as well as the driver's seat. And then you have the pop out hose for your heater. You got two of those. One there and then one down here. And then the defroster up top beautiful driver's seat with all that contrasting material it's really nice and as we sit down at the helm we have our hand stitch leather steering wheel tandem spoke has an awesome look feels great uh, I have electric assisted steering in the G23 so it takes all that torque off the wheel when you're pulling surfers or wakeboarders and uh, just makes for I think the best best driving experience in any inboard boat that you're going to find. We also have a nice tall upright mirror or mirror uh, windshield so you have great visibility out of the front of the boat no matter what you're doing. Um, no need to bolster up. They've got this thing designed to go through the water so you always have a, a line of sight on the horizon ahead of you. Link Panerai screen is tucked nicely down here to the right side where we have um, 
really any anything um, that you want to control can be done through the screen. You got your ballast system, your stereo, we have maps in here, uh, all your lighting and climate features, all the different rider presets for different activities you want to go do from shoot from foiling to surfing, you name it, it's all there. You can also create your own custom presets. Keyless ignition down low. New mirror, it's the rotating Roswell mirror. So you can swing this thing down and around. Uh, but a nice wide view, it's curved, so you can get a nice view of uh, who's back there behind you. Our dash is also fully vinyl wrapped with the nice stitching. And uh, got your phone holder here, just a nice storage cubby there. Leading us up into the front is the pocket door air dam. So that slides out, comes across. So those chilly days or evenings, you can fl flip that thing out and uh, keep everybody in the boat nice and comfortable. And then up in the bow, nice wide seating space up here in the front of the G. A few cup holders and grab handles, and then adequate storage to fit your whole entire boat cover and uh, fenders that go along with the Fender Pro option. Those clip in here, There's six of them for the boat. It's a really nice fit and finish and, and premium feel to this boat. That kind of covers our features and options on the G23 though. Hopefully I uh, gave you a good rundown and, and look at the interior and the outside of the boat. Be sure to check out our on water video when we get that posted up. We also have a nice review video on the G23 if you'd like an idea of how amazing the wake and wave are on the G23. Hit us up at N3 Boatworks. You can reach us at 317-845-9253. For more info on this beautiful G23 and the many other beautiful boats that we carry in our shop. Thanks for watching.